the entire universe is in our head. A point brought up by, I believe the name is Michael Shermer, on a Joe Rogan podcast. I think that's a lot to calculate there because, you know, is life just you? Nah, 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 fuck your girlfriend, your boyfriend, your husband, your wife, your mama, your daddy. No, no, no. When you're gone, the lights are off, in theory. All right, because I don't think anybody knows for sure about the afterlife. Just my opinion. But to think that um, either the universe is relevant or irrelevant uh, as a whole once um, you're gone, once one is gone. And I think of um, uh, Carl Sagan's point of... um, The pale blue dot when the I forget the name of the satellite that uh, left the the range of our solar system and took a, a picture of Earth on its way out and he Carl Sagan said something like uh, every person you've ever cared for known for loved for know of is on that pale blue dot. And, uh, is it beautiful? Is it disgusting? Is it pathetic? Is it humbling that, uh, that, 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 that is it? That that is true? And, uh, people, again, I, <laughs> I'm not impressed if I, you're on 30, 34, 40, 50 inch rims. Well, however big uh, you can make them now, and they're chrome, and they're spinning, and lights, and all this shit. I, I, I don't give a fuck. But there are people that um, believe, hey, look at me, look at me. Look, look what um, look what I have. And I'm thinking, uh, so, so what? And... Uh, Coming to that calculation, you know, it's a bit, um, <clears throat> um, I don't know if it's hypocritical or double meaning, I'm trying to think of the right word, proper word. What, what word will describe it best? Because although I uh, do what I can to be an effective capitalist, and uh, Looking back at the pale blue dot, you know, this drawing, this channel, it, it doesn't mean much, but that doesn't mean, oh, I quit. Oh, what's it all for? No. Because I've had uh, moments, simple moments, simple things, uh, simple company that are. almost as pleasant as orgasms but uh, just as memorable just as impactful just as living I guess that's the word living just as alive As I pay attention to my surroundings, um, you know, it, it is again, the thing that annoys me is a motherfucker walking with no purpose. And, uh, I mean, limited, like, um, as if you just picked up their 
favorite puppy and strangled it in front of their eyes and they were able to do, to do nothing about it and and I disagree with having that perspective on life and can I, I just see more and more people t accepting that fate man and when I when I encounter more people like that you know, I just have to um, again I just keep speaking on it because uh, I think eventually people will say hey come on un unfuck yourself man come on let's go move it let's go come on but you know it's gone to a point where even um, no don't tell me to hurry up don't raise your voice on me um, if I, if I want to quit, let me quit. Let me just be here and um, sulk. And uh, and it sucks when um, again when when it's someone you care for, someone with huge potential, someone with um, bigger, stronger, faster, more tools. You know that they could do it, but uh, some way in their mind they've calculated and accepted now nah, whatever dude and and it, it's a bit of a challenge to say you know what fuck it this motherfucker wants to lay in his bed of shit let him let her let them watching a Rick and Morty right now just so I could see if I could uh, pick up more to more stuff to draw and although for the moment um, space travel is fiction not possible man the the idea of doing it and meeting life forms and shit now seeing how stupid we are today by thinking that we're so cocky we know this and that and you know we barely up uh, we barely you know we haven't even crossed this no what well, we have crossed have we crossed the street no we have we have not crossed the street in, in our solar system no, we just, had a man step on the moon, a couple men. We landed a robot on a comet. And, uh, shit, yeah, hell yeah, I'll admit man, that I'm ignorant and that, uh, it's been a lot of time curious about what's possible and crawl my way, work my way it may be slowly but effectively towards that, towards knowing and I know, I know that um, when, uh, when, I, when I'm on my deathbed at, uh, preferably at 101 years old A dozen tranny prostitutes in Thailand. Eating lobster. Watching Rick and Morty season 47. I don't know. I don't wanna I don't wanna go out like that wondering what if ma'am. What if? To me, that that's a horror story, man.
Yeah, but the whole universe is in your mind, in theory, in theory. So tap into that, um, that ability of what's possible. Take action, take immediate action. Go forward. No excuses. Consume caffeine if you have to, god damn it. <laughs>